Hi, Mike's Carburetor Parts here. Working on a little uh, Carter YF one barrel carburetor, and I'm going to show you how to uh, test the accelerator pump on the bench and also uh, tell you a little bit about the nomenclature of this. Uh, this is the accelerator pump diaphragm, and uh, right here is the inlet check ball. Okay, that's how the fuel gets into the diaphragm. So when the uh, uh, stem is pushed down or the diaphragm is pushed down the uh, suction of the diaphragm going down and the, the weight of the fuel pushes the check ball down and allows the fuel in. Simple as that. Don't take these apart. Don't try to get that ball out. Just make sure it rattles good and clean it the best you can and leave her go because you'll uh, uh, you can't get the parts for it and you'll have trouble. Alright, so we're going to line this thing up. And uh, this is the uh, exhaust hole, by the way. Uh, this is where the fuel is pushed out on the upstroke here when it goes up. It forces the fuel out through this hole into here. up the passageway and out of the uh, main discharge. Okay, the main discharge will have a check ball in it like this. Put that in there and it'll have a check weight. Now this is an older YF. Now that check weight needs just enough room to move up so what happens when you uh, when the fuel goes up through here it forces this check weight up and the check ball off its seat and allows fuel uh, to squirt out of this small hole right here on the side. Okay, So you want to be sure this is clear from here to here, blow air through it. Same thing here, blow air through here, make sure it's coming out the top. Uh, now some YFs just use a check weight, the later ones. Okay. Uh, this is probably in the 50s or 60s, 70s. We'll use a check weight like this. No check ball. You just stick this in here. This is where it seals it. All right, so um, let's put this in. Now notice there's no gasket. The diaphragm acts as a gasket. Some of the, of the uh, old uh, uh, exploded view sheets will show a gasket down here underneath here. Uh, but it's not needed any these days. I did away with that. Let's see, make sure I get the right screws in here. that down in there and then so the diaphragm on this works just backwards from a, uh, a regular auxiliary pump from uh, oh, say a two jet or something like that where on the downstroke when the auxiliary pump is pushed down the throttle is open uh, it forces the fuel out. This one just the opposite on the upstroke. On the upstroke it forces the fuel out through the main discharge. So now I'm going to put a little bit of uh, mineral spirits in here so I can test it. And we'll have to pump this up and down. So, so now it should be filling the reservoir. And on the upstroke, as you can see, fuel comes out right here. Okay? All right, so that's good. Now, 
get, put a little bit of pressure on that chuck ball, it doesn't take much, and should get a little bit of pressure. You can see no fuel coming out there now. Okay. If uh, if it seems to be leaking through there, just take you a, uh, now I'd use a brass grip crunch, you don't use a screwdriver like I have here, and, and uh, tap on this a couple of times just to see, seat it, don't hit it too hard or you get the check ball stuck in there. And if you do get a check ball stuck, just heat it right here, turn the uh, carburetor upside down, and uh, Turn the carburetor upside down, heat it right here, tap the carburetor on your bench, and the check ball will fall out. Okay? Alright, so let's see. Now, if you hold the top, uh, you can put the top back on it if you want. You can see the, you can see the fuel nice squirt coming out of the bore right there, coming out of the main discharge. You see that? Okay, hopefully you can see that with camera. And there you go. And that one seems to work pretty good. So this is a good way to test your accelerator pump before you put it back on the car. Or you put it on there, you get in the hesitation. Uh, you need to go through those steps so you can figure out where the problem is. I showed you where the circuits are. So you just want to be sure those are clean. The check ball is in here. Uh, the check weight and check ball is in here or just the check weight depending on what you have and uh, I think that should cover that the accelerator pump part of it anyway alright well thank you for watching we do appreciate your business